What is up, YouTube? I am Nintendo Man 64, and I am bringing you guys a shock of shocks. Day one of the birthday bash. Now, what is the birthday bash? Well, like it or not, my birthday is coming up soon. And I wanted to play a bunch of video games or things and do stuff that makes me feel good. And I decided I would start with Pokemon Platinum. Something I haven't done in a very long time. In fact, I think my last video was rendered and completed around this time. So, well, this time last year. So, yeah. Now, what we're going to be doing is simple. We're going to be going and taking on the Elite Four for round two. Seeing as how I haven't done that in any Pokemon Let's Play I've done so far, I figured I may as well do it this time around. Here we are back at the Pokemon League. We've had a bunch of new Pokemon we can catch, we can acquire, all yada that, yada yada yada. And I've leveled everyone up to a bit more respectable levels because the Elite Four in this game didn't get... Certain trainers got heightened to greater powers and strengths and what have you. But here we are, we've got Loki here, our Houndoom, and his swagalicious uh, heel ball. With the moves Flamethrower, Sludge Bomb, Dark Pulse, and Nasty Plot. As you can see, he is mostly a special sweeper. Oh, darn it. Wrong buttons. Next up is our starter, Groot or Torterra, Grass Ground type. He'll be holding the Soft Sand. Pretty great offensive stats all around except for special attack. But for the most part, he's physical. And his moveset will reflect that. Using a heart skill, I taught him to move Wood Hammer, which is obviously an incredibly powerful grass type move. The only thing I wish I had left was, uh, like, I wish I had, like, something that could trigger not being hit by recoil, but... Hey, what are you gonna do? Not every Pokemon gets, uh, Rock Head for an ability. Also knows Crunch, Earthquake, and Rock Climb. I thought about getting rid of Rock Climb, but I really, other than Rock Slide, I really didn't have any moves that I would teach it and honestly if this thing needs to see action against a rock to uh, fire types in the elite four i did something wrong next up is serenity or altaria the only female on our team other than old bat but i didn't level up old bat so we're not worrying about that ha rhyme all right pretty decent stats all around not the best special attacker but I don't think we're going to be using Flamethrower in this gym, in this uh, challenge, because we have Houndoom, so I don't think we're going to have to worry about that. Uh, darn it. Did it again. Knows the moves Outrage, Fly, Flamethrower. It did know Aerial Ace, but I taught it Dragon Dance to take advantage of Bug's weaknesses and also to make Dragon Dance, uh, to make Outrage even stronger. Next up is Simba, our Luxray who has been uh, who is a physical war machine as you can see here fast and hits hard both physical and special attacks um it knew shockwave for a while but i replaced that with thunderbolt because i found the uh, tm behind the valley windworks yeah i did a lot off screen to make my team stronger and more effective next up is triton our vaporeon we got it as an EV back in Hard Home City. All the the ultimate special attacker on my team. With the moves Surf, Ice Beam, Acid Armor to take care of its weak physical defense, and Waterfall to get a physical attack in there. Though I have considered getting a different move to replace that. You know, like I thought about using Haze. Thought about using like Avalanche if it could learn it. I doubt it could, but you get the drill. And last up is Goku, who got almost no uh, traction in the Elite Four last time. Hopefully that'll change because he's got wickedly high stats now, and hopefully he will improve. He's got the XP share, so he's going to be my secret weapon. The only uh, sp attack he has in the game is that's not physical, is Aura Sphere. But he also knows Swords Dance to make Extreme Speed and Brick Break even more powerful. Now before we go and challenge, I do have to make sure I buy a few items to ensure that we 
don't run into any problems. Now, I have a ton of money. I've got a lot of it from uh, fighting in the uh, fighting the uh, gym leaders and rematching them. Because I wanted to, I wanted to get my Pokemon, make my Pokemon tougher, obviously, and that should be good for that. Uh, revives. Oh wow, we're good on revives. Ah, you never can be too good on revives, though. And let's see. I used a lot of Ultra Balls trying to catch certain Pokemon, specifically a Skarmory, which did not want to get caught. Yeah, I caught a lot of Pokemon off screen. So I did good for myself. And let's buy 13 of these. Actually, you know what? We could go all out with buying a by like buying everything. And I think I think we'll just use a sizable amount of what we have. All right. Now remember, guys, the Elite 4 in this obviously got its levels jacked up considerably. And the last thing you're going to want to be able to do is uh, that, you know, that sort of thing. Um, so you're going to want to make sure you have your Pokemon at reasonably high levels. The highest of which that we have is uh, Triton. But I think Loki will be able to skyrocket a, at least a couple of levels here. And we're not being stopped. Just to, I did heal them in uh, back in Twin Leaf Town, so let's proceed. Hopefully, we'll do better this time around. All right, first up is Aaron, the Bug type user. Uh, I believe they have all the same Pokemon. They're just jacked up to higher levels. It's not like in other Pokemon games where they'll actually increase, they'll actually change the Pokemon they have usable to them. I wish they would, you know, mostly because I want to uh, see other bug types and other Pokemon in general. Plus, I really rather not face Cynthia's Garchomp, all things considered. Alright, but this is Loki's first challenge, a Yan Mega. And if I can get off a nasty plot and Loki can live, I think we've got this fight in the bag. And it used double team. That's uh, not good. Plus, I'm willing to bet it has speed boost. Yep. Oh, man. They did good with this team construction. Uh, that should do decent damage. Not a whole lot. And flamethrower. Got him. Nice job, Loki. I'm proud of you. All right. And down goes the uh, the bug there. Alright, Goku, you keep getting stronger. Alright, Heracross is up next. I don't see any reason to uh, switch out. Especially with the, na with the nasty plot I got off, which basically makes my, uh, makes Loki almost unbeatable. Uh, the only one I don't think I'll have Loki face is Drapion, and that's because Drapion is Poison Dark and not Poison Bug or whatever. I know this because when I do my action replay, I might use a Drapion. Alright, Vespaquin. This is not going to be fun. Vespaquin knows Power Gem, so you want to be careful with that if you use Fire, if you're using a Fire type. But since Loki is fast and now has and has a nasty plot under him, I don't think we have to worry about that. Case and point. That's three down. Uh, next up should be uh, who's his fourth one? Oh, Caesar! Oh boy! Oh dear! <laughs> oh dear! I don't think you're gonna survive this, Caesar. Nothing against you, personally. I, I, I just think you're just not going to survive. And you did not. Case in point. Alright. The one tough thing about having Pokemon at excruciatingly high levels is the fact that at, at some point they just stop leveling up. Like, they just stop leveling up so quickly. 
Like, I wonder how much experience I'll get if, should I be able to beat Garchomp. Alright, Ice Fang. That should not do a lot of damage. I have high defense, even though it is a quad weakness, but he doesn't have the same type attack bonus. And that happened. I hate you. I hate your face. I hate your face. Come on, use something like Poison Jab. Come on. X Scissor. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, okay. One thing that sucks about you, Groot, you are incredibly slow. But I didn't have any other ground types I could put in. Oh, come on! A critical hit after getting frozen? That's such bullshit. <sighs> Alright, Serenity would get pulverized by that thing. Alright, Goku. Show us what you're made of. Swords dance. Show everyone how strong you are by powering up. Aerial Ace. Very odd learn set you've given this thing. Aerial Ace, Ice Fang, X Scissor. And you don't even have one Poison type move on it? There better be a Poison type move on this thing. Otherwise, I'm going to be very disappointed in you. That would mean you don't know how to raise a freaking Drapion. Alright, you just finished the job here, Goku. One shot, one kill. Good for you, Goku. Alright, one down. Three to go for the Elite Four, and then, of course, the Champion. I don't understand why you have to fight the Elite Four again. Because what, did Cynthia beat you? Okay, I remember that. I remember that. Someone, when I was playing Pokemon Black, told me... Oh, no, you have to go back and challenge the Elite Four. I'm like, wait, why do I have to go back and challenge them? I already challenged them. No, but you have to, uh, you have to defeat, uh, what's his name? You have to defeat, what, what, Red damn, what was his name? Oh, Alder. Yeah, you had to defeat Alder. I'm like, no, I don't. But, 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 yes, you do. I'm like, okay. Have you ever, do you subscribe to the theory of the Elder Wand? What? The Elder Wand, you know. Dumbledore didn't just get the Elder Wand back because someone was a big doo-doo head, and Harry Potter didn't get control of it because of being some doo-doo head. When you lose something, it's for good until you can reclaim it back on your own. Do I have any, uh... God, I have... Oh, I'm, I'm good on... I have elixirs and max elixirs, so I'm good. Um... Speaking of which... Uh, Loki, let's take that amulet coin away from you. Um, take that. Actually, I think she starts off with wish cat. Wish shish 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 shish. With wish shish 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 cash. So I think we'll have Groot go out there first. And then we'll have Triton deal, deal with the rest of that. Um, Loki should get almost nothing. No experience here, so... Uh, how are you doing, Goku? I will let you level up, why not? Because you're going to get no experience against the, uh... The, gra the uh, fire types that we're coming up against. But yeah, they're like, oh no, you have to fight Alder. Yeah, I'm not fighting Alder. Because Alder lost to N. Just because he just walks right back in and says, No, I'm champion now. That doesn't mean he's champion. I'm better than you because you lost to N and I beat N. Deal with it. Alright, this is Bertha. Her ground types. As powerful a type as ground is, it is easily defeated by common types. So if you wish to use ground types, use them with caution. Or in the case of the guy from... Uh, Gen 5, use Excadrill. Alright, Wood Hammer. Quad. Uh. 
quad damage or times four effective against them plus the same type of attack bonus makes it times six I used to think it was times eight but that'd be a little ridiculous all right and Goku I right, Gliscor all right my most powerful Pokemon come on out Triton The one thing that's uh, the one th that's the one thing I've always disliked about ground types. They're so easily beaten by common types. In hindsight, maybe I should have put out a uh, an acid armor here. But I think Gliscor is the only one faster than Triton. Plus, I think everything else on her team, with the exception of uh, uh with the exception of uh. Hippowdon has a uh, a quad we as a quad weakness moving forward. I know she has a golem. I think she has a Rhyperior. Speaking of that golem, there it is, and there it goes. I need to set up like a theme for my birthday bash. So you'll see, you'll have seen it that by now, obviously, but I, I, I want to make one myself. Okay, I have no idea what ability this Rhyperior has, and if it has the one I'm thinking of, I'm gonna be really sad. Uh, what would it, what would it be? Uh, Solid Rock, which I think takes away some of the oh never mind not like it mattered even if it had solid rock that's one thing that actually made me want to use a Rhyperior in uh, this game all right hip out on I don't get how hip out on goes from being a sand colored hippo to being an evil black colored hippo but I digress I'm drinking my milk in my Black Widow cup. Yes, I have a cup with Scarlett Johansson's face on it. Deal with it. Alright, there we go. That's two down. And this time we didn't even lose a Pokemon. Alright, next up is... Um, next up is uh, the Fire Guy. Don't remember his name. Remember it was something stupid though. It wouldn't be a Pokemon game if it wasn't stupid, though, to be honest. Alright, so Loki should get the bulk of the Psychic types in the last fight. I'm just doing my math here correctly. Um, I think I'm going to have Groot come in just so we can get the Amulet Coin experience here. And then Loki, what are we going to do with you? Item... Um, we'll give you the dread plate so you'll be ready to take on the psychic types though once again I think I'm gonna have to switch items what does serenity have the dragon fang okay I will switch that out when we go to fight the dragon guy but we can't get to the dragon guy if we can't flint that's his name son of a bitch I remember it was something fire related no Pokemon game will be complete without name puns my personal favorite being Roxanne from the, from the Hoenn region. All right. All right, Caratop, let's do this. Everybody's ready, everybody's pumped, everybody's set. Simba, I'm sorry you're not getting enough experience here. Uh yeah, yeah, you're not you're not getting that experience. Let's give it let's give it to Simba. Simba deserves it. Especially since I'm kind of nervous because the one Pokemon I need him to take out could be a lot stronger than him. That being, uh, that being, uh, Cynthia's Milo, not Milotic, uh, Togekiss is the one I'm worried about. But it doesn't really matter. Before we do anything, let's save in case something horrible goes wrong. Fast forward, fast forward, fast forward! 
I'm proud of myself that I haven't fast forwarded through any of the fights so far though. I'm very proud of myself with those regards. Thank you. Alright, let's do this. I was waiting for you. The master of fire types. I hated him in Diamond and Pearl. I hated this guy in Diamond and Pearl so much. Because he there weren't that many fire types in the Sinnoh region. Like I think the only ones they had were um uh the Infernape line and the uh Rapidash line and of course. Um half the damage. I hate the fact that they use Sunny Day. I, do, do, do I even have the TM for Rain Dance? Because if that's the case, if they're going to bring Rapidash out next and use that uh, Solar Beam strategy, I'm going to bring out Groot. Let's just get rid of this Houndoom first. Alright. Simba, good for you. Yeah, Vaporeon, you're not going to get a lot of use here. Alright, Infernape. Um, while I think Groot could handle it, I think I'm going to go with Altaria. Mostly because she resists both fighting and fire. And I can get, out of, get off a of Dragon Dance. And Serenity has very high physical defense. Not the highest of a Pokemon I've ever had, but still. Now, you should not be faster than Infernape, even with this power boost. But, just saying. Um, with that said, let's try Fly. Oh, wow, you are faster. Good for you. You know what I wish? I know what I wish Flare Blitz did. I wish Flare Blitz had the uh, same effect as, uh, what was it? As like high jump kick, where it just keeps going and it crashes. Holy crap, Serenity! You didn't get a lot of love in the uh, fight with the, in the Elite Four run last time either, so I'm proud of you. Alright, Flareon. Alright, seems appropriate, Triton, that you can take out your flaming other. Alright, so who should he have left? Rapidash and Magmortar, I believe. Alright, Flareon. You might live through this, because I remember your special defense was pretty okay, and I hate you. I hate your face. I hate your existence. I hate everything about your existence. But that's okay. Because I am actually... Uh, I'll, uh, Flareon is one of those that I just never show love to because obviously I don't like Flareon. A lot of you know that about me. If there's one Pokemon out there that I loathe, it's Flareon and it's because of how much missed potential it has. Now, obviously, as I've said in previous videos, it does get a hell of a lot better throughout as the games get better, as the games progress. And I believe by Gen 6, it can actually learn Flare Blitz at a pretty okay level. So, alright, so Triton. Alright, Rapidash. Um, let's get Groot out there. Even if he is going to die. Which should not happen. Because he's very strong physically. And an earthquake might... Solar Beam? I was right to take you out. To take uh, Triton out then. Alright Groot. You take care of this shit. You know what you're doing. Like a champ, Groot. Like a champ. One shot kill. Alright, last up is Magmortar. This is the only one whose stats I'm not quite sure about. I know it's an excellent Pokemon. I just don't remember like if it's 
I think it's slightly slower than Magmar, but it's more powerful. Obviously, with Mortar in its name, you would expect that. Come on, Groot. Groot! Be a champ! Oh, oh well. Alright, um... I'm afraid this thing knows Focus Blast, so I'm not gonna go after him with him. Let's go with Triton. It should know Thunderbolt, though. That I know. Yep, there's a Thunderbolt. I would teach my Magmortar the same things. I would teach it Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, Solar Beam, and Sunny Day. Or Focus Blast, depending on my mood. Alright, Triton. If you die here, that's okay. I'm going to... I have a plan here. And my plan... God, I don't think that was 30 HP on a Magmortar level 73. Okay, um... Hyper Potion. To heal Serenity. Because I think Triton's done here. I don't think there was anything I could have done to save him. Especially since Magmortar's faster than you. Now, Altaria, on the other hand, I think can handle this just fine. Alright, let's try a Dragon Dance. Oh, Schnikers Hyper Beam. Alright, I get a free shot in. I get a free turn in, at least. Um, there you go. Alright, I get a free turn of attacking in. Which is very, very good. So I can level up my stats twice, making sure I'm faster than it. And then, hit it with Outrage. Which should take care of it. That a girl serenity. Do daddy proud. Alright. Only lost two Pokemon in that fight, and one was a strategic sacrifice. Alright. Last up is Lucian, I believe. Or Lucian, I don't know how he pronounces it. I don't care either. The psychic guy. Alright, Serenity. There you go. And how we do, we're very good on revives. So far, only Groot's died. Well, Groot died twice, and then Triton was a strategic sacrifice, of course. One thing I noticed this team lacks, other than Vaporeon, is a special, like, super special attacker. I mean, Goku could qualify as that technically, but I mean... Like, I don't have a Psychic-type user, I don't have... Like, Houndoom has pretty good special attack, but not amazing special attack, if you catch my drift. Speaking of you, him, you're up, Houndoom. Okay, so... Um, let's take that Dragon Fang from you. And let's take the Amulet Coin from you. And give it to Serenity, because I believe... I'm going to be using that, I'm going to be using Serenity to take out Gallade. I don't really have anything else that can take it out, other than Altaria. Or Serenity. I keep forgetting to call them by their names. Except Groot, I will always remember Torterra as Groot. Even if I use another Torterra in another game, it's still only always going to be Groot. Alright. This is where boys become men here. And we only got all that's left is Cynthia after this. And you use psychic types. I remember. I remember going up against uh, him and thinking he used ghost types. What? I hadn't played the game in such a long time where it's like... Alright, I remember... You use certain types i just don't remember all of them all right one nasty plot should be all i need unless you know focus blast in which case loki's a goner reflect 
Oh, you poor damn fool. You poor damn fool, Mr. Mime. I know you've got pretty high special defense, and that's what has me a little worried, but... Yeah, you're a goner. Fare thee well, Loki. Oh, sorry, fare thee well, Mr. Mime. Alright, Gallade, alright. This is what I was worried about. Alright, Serenity. Alright, now what could Gallade know that could do a lot of damage to me? Psycho Cut's probably the only thing I'd be seriously worried about. Alright, Night Slash is also pretty. Ah, Stone Edge! Sh shit. Oh, Serenity, come on, you can make it! Oh, baby! Come on, Serenity. I need you to pull through here. Oh, you sick, fast, defensive bitch! I love you! Come on. Crit. Get a crit. Crit, 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 crit. Uh, oh, why? Oh, you brought out your most powerful Pokemon? That's overkill, dude. Not cool. Alright, so that's... Alright. Nice job, Serenity. You did your part. Alright, freaking... Uh... Alright, I can't bring out Goku because of... Reasons. So, Simba! Let's, let you, let's have you make your debut here. Lower its attack power. And if you get injured on the next play, I could use a revive and heal up Altaria. Alright, uh, Thunderbolt. I've always wanted to use Gallade. I just always, whenever I catch a Ralts, I just always want to use Gardevoir. Because Gardevoir is such a good Pokemon, too. Oh. That did nothing. Um, change of plans! Simba! You are a meat shield! I know that's not what you want to be. In fact, judging from your appearance, I should have named you Scar, but still. Oh dear! Yeah, I saw that coming. Shit. Uh, okay. Alright, Goku. I need a little bit more time. So, I need... To... No, I need to heal Serenity so we can finish this. I can't believe Thunderbolt did that little damage to this thing. Alright. Um, now that you're healthy, this thing doesn't have anything that can do major damage to you, so maybe... Just maybe, Goku. And there it goes. Why didn't you Psycho Cut if it knew Drain Punch this whole time? That makes no sense. And I'm glad to see that that friggin' uh, what's it called did nothing. I'm glad to see that that Intimidate did nothing. I'm so glad it did nothing. I mean, Psycho Cut kills off Simba. Then you got the friggin', uh, what's it called that killed... Drain Punch that killed Lucario. Man, this is, like, ridiculous. Alright, come on. Kill. 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 Thank you! Alright, Serenity. Good job. Holy crap, that was a lot of experience. Alright, Espeon. Don't know what this thing would know that could do damage to me other than Signal Beam. And that's like, that's a difficult move to teach us beyond. Uh, nasty plot. Make Loki invincible. Yep, there's Signal Beam. Like I said, that's the only move that could do major damage to me. Shadow Ball would do nothing. And... Not, and so would uh, 
Psychic would do literally nothing to me. Alright, so let's see. We took out Espeon, Gallade, and Mr. Mime. Bronzong. Yep, saw that coming. Alright, Defensive Tank 101. Alright, Heat Proof or Levitate, I don't care which one you have. I'm just gonna scorch the crap out of you and hope you die. Alright, let's see. I think it knew Levitate. Yes, it knew Levitate. Thank goodness. Alright. Alright, and last up is Alakazam. Who, of course, is always a bit of a problem. Now this... Ah, uh, yeah, I was like, yeah, that should be faster than me. And sure enough, it was. Alright, Alakazam has always been a problem for me, so... It's a level 72, no doubt, no less. Alright, so Groot, you're up. Uh, crunch? Let's see how much Crunch does. You know, if you live through an Alakazam Psychic, which I doubt. Highly, highly doubt. Oh, you did! Good for you, Groot! And Crunch? Oh! So close! So close! So close! Oh, you jackass. Oh, come on. Use something dumb. Like, use, like, Focus Blast. Oh, of course not. <sighs> I hate move spammers. Even myself when I do it. But alas, I'm running out of options. Alright. Outrage. This is my only chance. If not, I'm gonna have to use a lot of revives. 120, high attack. This thing has low physical def physical defense. And 120, outrage is the best move I've got, and it didn't do it. Typical, typical, typical. Ah, uh, shit. Alright, Triton. I'm not gonna be he wasting turns healing. So let's just finish this. If I die, I die. I don't think I should. Because it's not a same type attack bonus. Yep. Oh, thank god. Ugh, oh, stupid Alakazam, man. He almost took out my entire team. All right. Holy shit. Okay. If I recall correctly, she starts off with a Spiritomb. Groot, that's your job. Simba, you get Togekiss and... Uh... Blah, 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 uh... Milo tick. Um, Triton. You get. Hold on, Spiritomb. Gotta remember what she has for a second. Spiritomb. The unholy terror that is Garchomp. That's your problem, Triton. Um, Togekiss, Lucario, Milotic, and Roserade, if I'm not mistaken, which can be, I've been mistaken before. I 
I have been highly mistaken before. <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, okay. Now, how do we do this? Alright, Groot. Actually, you know what? Do I have a charcoal? That's what I'm looking, gonna look for. Oh, if only the Magmarizer was like a fire plate or something. Oh, well, I don't think I do. <sighs> okay. Alright. So, Loki, since you are coming in the fight, I'm gonna give you the amulet coin. Um, I'm going to give the XP share to Goku again, mostly because I want Simba to hold the magnet. Groot, you're getting the soft sand. And Serenity. Just in case you go up against an ice type attack. I believe I still have a Yachi Berry. Yes, I do. Alright, Groot, you're up first. Don't know why I switched it with Altaria, but whatever. Alright, so it should be Groot, Simba, Triton, and then you three are uh, Loki, and then Goku and Serenity are support. Oh dear. Let's, this is where boys become men. I gotta take on the lovely Cynthia. Oh boy. They did this theme so well in uh, Super Smash Bros. Spiritomb. This time, unlike in Pokemon Black, we're at a pretty high level as it is. Now, if Spiritomb doesn't have a weakness yet, Gen 6 is when they introduced Fairy type. Alright, so... Hmm, the question is, who would they bring out to face Groot? If it's Milotic, then we're good. If it's anything else, we're gonna have to think here. Alright. One pain in the ass down, five to go. Alright, Togekiss! Okay. Um, normal flying type. Two great weaknesses that I have of it would be ice and electric. So, come out, Simba. You've only appeared in one fight so far, or two fights so far, and neither of which you were that effective in. Actually, no, I don't think you appeared in the, fi the uh, fight with uh, Flint. Oh well. Or a sphere should be damage dealing, but not as damage dealing as it could be. All I'm hoping for is a thunderbolt could either paralyze it or get a crit, because this thing has incredible special defense. Oh wow, that did more than enough for me. I swear to God, if you get a crit, I swear to God. I swear to God. Alright, come on, Simba. Come on, Simba! Tank that shit, Simba! Oh boy, good job, Simba. Alright, down to Togekiss. Goku. Ugh. Just seeing that thing's name gives me the creeps. Oh my god, just seeing that thing's name is terrifying. Oh, Garchomp. Oh, Garchomp. I'm not taking any chances this time. Oh my god. Triton, just live. That's all I ask. Even if it's... Oh! 
Oh, you amazing, you amazing thing! Now I hope you guys know why I love Vaporeon as much as I do. Oh, now the fun can begin. It's so evil of the game to give her a guard jump. Acid armor. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Fudge. Oh dear. All right, Serenity. Freaking critical hits, my ass. Max revive. Wake up, Triton. I need you. You are the universe right now. If Dragon Rush misses, that would be nice, but it won't because I know my luck. Uh, oh my god, with the stupid critical hits for Dragon Rush! Okay. Acid armor. Acid armor, and then full restore. Oh, you son of a bitch! Ugh. Triton's dead. Unless Dragon Rush misses, Triton's dead. I can't think of... I really can't think of any way, this, any way out of this. Triton's a goner. Again, because of this stupid bullshit. Oh, I'm gonna make you flinch. So, really, this sucks. Brick break. Oh my god, that's two critical hits! That's bullshit! Have I even gotten one? That I would like to know. Oh my god. Can Dragon Rush miss? Please, that would be very nice of you, game. Okay, come on. This thing's methodically using this Earthquake Dragon Rush alternate strategy. But I'm gonna be an asshole. Three critical hits! Are you kidding me? Oh, and of course, naturally, Dragon Rush is never gonna miss! this many full restores if the game would play fair. But no, when you play dirty, I play dirty. That's how it goes from now on. Bullshit. Oh, well you just got your acid armor out, so I'm just gonna get a critical hit. <laughs> Yeah, I'm playing dirty now. I don't care. Not risking it. I'll go for a hyper potion here, but I'm not risking it. I don't care. You want to play dirty game? I will play dirty too. Let's see how this goes fairly, you stupid friggin' thing. Now, just to be an a-hole, I'm gonna use it twice. Just to be an a-hole now. Now you see how it ha what happens. Now you see what happens. And now, you die. 
You deserve it. You've got to be kidding me. Four critical hits. Unless your ability is heightened critical hit ratio, that's bullshit. That doesn't even kill him. That's so fan flippantastic. That's so fantastic. So fantastic. Okay, this I would expect to get a critical hit off of. But because I actually, because the game actually started to say, no, maybe we should play fair. Stupid critical hits. Bullshit. Ugh. Alright, Triton's at level 70. Good for you, buddy. You earned that. Alright, Roserade. That's your job, Loki. Nasty plot, and Flamethrower should do it. And if he brings out Lucario next, she brings out Lucario next, that'll be the same. Alright, poisoned. Not the end of the world. Kill, 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 kill. There you go. Alright. Alright, who's coming out next? Alright, Milotic's coming out next. Uh. Hey, Gru, come on out! I have a plan here. If this thing uses Ice Beam, I know what I'm going to do. Wait, send Groot in. Try to lure it to use a water attack and have Triton heal off of it. But it used Ice Beam, so it'll at least resist it. Good for you, Triton. What I need you to do, Triton, is I need you to wall. Because I need to heal up the rest of my team. Except Serenity. She did her part. She was meant to be a sacrificial lamb anyway for this fight. Alright, Aqua Ring, which doesn't make any sense. Alright, full restore. Bring Loki back at full strength. Mirror Coat. Wow, you didn't teach this thing Dragon Pulse? That's interesting. That's an interesting choice of yours. Alright, now that everyone's healed. Acid armor. Just a troll. I know you have no physical attacking moves. Alright, once I get this thing into a, uh, what's a call it lock. Like, once it just constantly is using mirror code. Alright. I am gonna risk it now. Alright, group, come on out. We'll let you have this Milo tick. Alright. If this fails, we have Simba, so... Don't worry if you can't kill him, Groot. Or kill the Milotic, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Of course, I would love for you to live. But that wasn't happening. Because apparently Milotic has incredible special attack. I thought it just had incredible special defense, but whatever. Alright, Simba. That's not gonna help, but... Thank you anyway. Alright, Mirror Code's probably coming out next, and I don't think you can kill it. Uh, yep, saw that coming. Ah, oh, boy, yeah, just, yeah, you go die, Simba, you did, you did your part. Alright, Triton, 
Once again. Alright, let's see if we can get a crit here. Come on, surf shit. Oh, snap! One HP you're living by. Oh, you bitch! Oh, man. Oh, man. Come on, Simba. One last one, and... Oh, my God, what the stupid... Oh, I'm just slightly faster than you. Bullshit. I hate you, Milo Tech. I think I wanted to use you in a future Let's Play. Potentially use you. That ain't happening now. Dipshit. Hmm. I have an idea. Come on. Come on! Freeze it! Come on! Why am I the only one that can't get anything to work right? I was like, I swear to God, if you freeze. Come on! Freeze! Why are you not freezing? Bullshit! Where are my elixirs at? Freeze! Everybody! Ah, oh, damn. Oh, well. Alright. Thunderbolt! There you go. Finally! Mercifully, the end. All right, Goku. All right, Simba, you get out of there. Okay. Flamethrower. Come on, Scorch him. Come on, Loki. Come on, Loki. Ah, oh, damn. Yeah, you're a goner. Alright, Goku. You wanna try hanging in there? Or a spear? Yeah! Hit him with that Kamehameha and take send him home! Woo! Oh, boy. Goku coming through in the clutch! Just like he always does. Holy crap. Uh, holy crap, that was tough. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. That hurt. Oh, wow, that was tough. I'll concede you that, that, Cynthia. Once again, you continue to prove you're the, one of the best trainers out there. Oh, all right. Put my team in this Hall of Fame again. Don't know why we have to do it twice, but whatever. Oh, dear. Groot! Simba! Triton! Loki! Goku! And... Serenity! My Hall of Fame roster!
Well done, guys. Well done. And I will see you guys tomorrow when we play Mario Party 3. Until then, sayonara.